What up, y'all? It's your boy Sun Low again. And right back at you with another layout fly spread of a few things that don't really represent one outfit at all, but pieces that could intertwine and you can mix it in with each other. Uh, it's really a whole color scheme and uh, theme behind it as well. We're dealing with orange, green, and navies as opposed to also sportsmen, outdoorsmen, and the specific type of uh, breed more so here would be like mooses and deers. All right, let's go. So, you know, the sportsman crown right here always been a good, you know, amplifier to an outfit when you're wearing those colors. There's multiple um, different colors of these hats. So I have the orange one. I wish I had the other, the blue and the green. I think there's a tan one too, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. I can all be wrong. But nevertheless, this is still a fly gem to have. Bam! Right there to the T to go with it. You know, opposite colors. But still, you still got to like, you know, finesse it though when you have it. So... To the turtleneck knit, um, <clears throat> that knit right there is definitely um, the matching knit to that set right there. Love that um, color green and orange together. And then, you know, as I move along, mosey on down here, rugby hoodie knit right here, man. This is some fine wool right here. Like, it's like some, like, Angola hair type of wool. Um, I always love this piece right here. This um has the silhouette of um white, but you know, nevertheless, you know, still does a good job with the other colors and other pieces. Here's the matching socks. Now the socks aren't as the same green, but those are the matching socks. Apparently, you know, that's what the socks came out like. I mean, still no, it's still the set. Um, I love the. The orange um, toes and heels on these socks, you know, banging. Now, respect the wildlife right here. Polo sport, um, sportsman piece right here. Definitely, you know, Marvel to have. You can rock with all of this if, you know, need to be. You know, the green, the orange, the navy was an iconic standout piece. Um, definitely in the 90s, it, it, did its, it did its numbers out there, man. A lot of heads was, you know, trying to get that. Um, here's a vest I would wear with all of this. Denim is supply. Aztec vest. Um, reversible. Still playing with the orange and the greens in there. The fire um, extract on the diamonds, you know, just can't help but, like, you know, feel like you feel that orange hue um heavier in there even though it's just blended in with the with the burgundies hey that green makes it stand out banging vest man must have for the collection and as for like another outspoken vest right here you have the leather shoulders and the yellow inside the guts of it um impeccable you also have the leather patch for polo. Um, it's just, you know, an iconic piece. There was a few other colors of this vest, but green to me was the best color. Uh, I really like that vest a lot. Then we can go back to the Respect Wildlife patch. Again, it's the enlarged patch that came out um, 2018 to 2019 winter, I believe. Um, banging piece right there come down come across <clears throat> a little bit and boom quality outdoor sportsman you know enlarged patch on a rugby that the orange uh green and navy on there but with the yellow band on a collar inside collar that just makes it just wow like i mean that could be played with so many different things too you know can't front on that um here go another sportsman piece. Um, it's not dealing with the moose. It's dealing with the fish, but it also has another cookie on there. Um, Outfitters, fishing game. 
um, patch. I like this a lot because it's the green, it's the navy, the orange. However, you have like certain little specks in there. You know what I mean? Boom. Look at that orange band on the inside of the uh, collar. Also comes with the hoodie attached to it. You know, the drawstring effect. Uh, for the campers, outdoors, division, you know what I'm saying? You have your TP right there. And you have some other prints dealing with probably um, weight of materials. I don't know. However, if you come along down here, we have this wildlife preserve patch from Polo Jeans Company on the orange chambray. Like classic um, vintage Polo Jeans right there. If you notice, I have... Uh, blue label polo Ralph Lauren, uh, rugby Ralph Lauren, also denim and supply Ralph Lauren, and polo jeans Ralph Lauren, all mixed in with the same type of color schemes. Um, going back up, you see that Aztec zip up fleece that dropped also in the winter of 018 and 19 wildlife um, patch on that. This is, um, has. Um, specs on the um, zippers for double, I mean, not double, um, RLX, pardon me. It's definitely a performance fleece um, zip up right there. Great piece to have to rock over any of these to blend that up. And, you know, so I'm coming down. Boom. Got to throw another little t-shirt in there. This is a green t-shirt that I have. It's, um, it's, it's very detailed. This looks like, <laughs> like, like a membership, like, it says members for ROPC. It's just a fishing club slash hunting, outdoorsmen, sportsmen. It's just really, really well done. As you can see, there's some signatures on there. It's very detailed, this piece right here, man. It's always a good piece to have. Um, vintage piece as well. And as I'm going to go along with, the, with my sock game for this, those are the type of wool socks I'd play out with any of this right here. Um, here you go, a green line um, cotton wool blend. You know, definitely vintage socks right here I had for many, many, many. I might have had these socks for like 15 years. <laughs> Real talk. And as I come back a little bit, you know what I mean? That you just see how all these pieces kind of like can blend in. And, you know, you just take the initiative to be like, yo, I'm going to rock this with that and that with this. You know, and, you know, of course I have shoes and pants and belts and stuff like to play with this. You know, but this is just some sportsmen, outdoorsmen. Green, orange, and navy, you know, specifically, those are the colors that I'm trying to, like, blend up with. But most important, it's um, the antler animals, man, the animals with the antlers on them. You know, them antlers, boy. Or, and that there is my fly spread master's layout. And hopefully, you know, y'all enjoy. You know what I mean? Real talk. Thanks for watching. You know, appreciate all the love. And uh, please, you know, drop a comment, a like. And if you don't like it, you could speak on that too. So hopefully, you know, this is something you enjoyed. All right, now, uh, see y'all soon. Ayak.